morning YouTube what is up everyone I hope everyone is having a good day so far man my last three videos I'm honestly really humbled I'm I'm blown away by how many views the last three videos alone are getting and the support that you guys give me and I'm not sure what's going on I don't know what it is that you like about the videos let me know <laughs> in the comment section below but anyway man I did promise to do something in one of the videos also also that also means I could tell you which company I work for so, I guess I'll tell you, but only if we reach at least 200 likes. I mean, I've never gotten 8,000 views and 1,000 likes, etc. I guess it's time for me to show you where I work. So let's go ahead and go to the office right now and show you and tell you exactly where I work. Let me tell you this, let me tell you right now, your exquisite kiss still burning. Didn't know I missed this fashion in life. It's all mine, let me tell you why Money's up with your smile It's impossible, not melting Irresistible Alright guys, what's up YouTube? So, I am in traffic right now Going to work, traffic is so bad I woke up pretty early this morning Traffic right now isn't too bad This is nice, right? This is nice traffic But, the thing is though If I leave my house at 8 a.m. I will get to work by 9 But then, if I leave my house at 8 a.m. It will take 50 minutes to go to work but if I leave at 6.30 like I did today, then it only takes me 30 minutes. So for me, someone where time is so tight and valuable, I'd rather leave early, sacrifice some sleep, so I can leave early and work on things and get to work sooner than just leave later. And I, that's just how I think. So anyway, man, I'm almost at work, so I'll see you guys when I get there. I promise to let you guys know which company I work for, but here we go. Anyway, this is where I work. I'm Schnorr Magazine, so I am here at the office right now. I actually go through the back door, and so since I'm gonna show you guys exactly where it is that I work, I'm gonna go through the front door right now. So here's the building right now. This is the building of where it is that I actually work. Pretty nice, man, I like it. I really enjoy this, but let's go inside real quick. I am in the conference room right now. Um, if in case you're wondering where I am right now, let's see if this is wide enough. Um, where I am right now, this is the conference room. This is actually where I had my first interview a year ago, and when I did interview with them a year ago, I didn't get the job, <laughs> which, is, which is totally fine, to be honest. Um, and now, one year later, I came back here. This is the room I sat in. I sat on this seat. Uh, the person who interviewed me sat on this seat or this one right over there. And what we did is pretty much we, I brought my MacBook Pro, shared my code on here. He, yeah, he gave me coding tests a year ago. I think I passed it pretty well. But anyway, other than that, uh, when I came in again for the second time, for the second time I interviewed a year later, which was a couple weeks ago, and I didn't even do a coding test. We just came in here, we talked about code, we talked about Vue.js. I keep hitting this. And that's pretty much how it went. And anyway, man, so where I work right now, okay, where I work, I work up there. And you probably can't even see it right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you my office, I got permission to do this, I'm excited. And I'm gonna try to do this before everyone else comes into the office because I'm still really shy here. And everything that's said out here, because it's an open office environment, everything you say out there, everyone can hear. So I'm gonna try to do this now before everyone gets here. And there might be some people here, but anyways, let's do this. All right, so this is where I work. I mean, this is the section, this is the small lobby where people go up to. Alright guys, so um, it looks like there's some people <laughs> in the office. I'm a little shy right now, so I was gonna try to get more B-roll. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get some breakfast and coffee. But check this out, check this out. Entrepreneur. Okay, so someone taught me this other day. I'm gonna get light, which is the right coffee. Short, oh, wait, put this down here. Short. 
start. All right, let's gonna do it real quick. Okay, so, dude, check this out, guys. Now I wanna show you, look at all these cup of noodles, man. Uh, boom, check that out. So shrimp, we got the veggie one. Thank you for thinking of me. And we got chicken. We also have this huge fridge. All these snacks down over here. TV, that's on literally all day. <laughs> but yeah, so let me go ahead and get my coffee. Get prepare my breakfast. And I'll see you guys upstairs. All right guys, so I'm here at my desk right now. Um, it's 8 a.m. sharp, so I went and came in at 7 a.m. from whatever I needed to film. But yeah, this is where I work, man. Entrepreneur Magazine, that's how I work. So I hope you like a little bit of that b-roll of my office. I actually did get permission to make sure I can do that. I came into work pretty early today. I came in, I woke up at 6 a.m., made sure I got here at 7 a.m. Um, I kind of took a nap in my car for 30 minutes, got here at 7.30, and dedicated that time coming in early to get b-roll for you guys. Um, but yeah, so if you're watching this, it's because you want to know um, the name of the company that I actually work for. It is not Treehouse. Treehouse is just a partner of mine. But the company that I do work for is Entrepreneur Magazine. If you want to check it out, go to entrepreneurmedia.com. Um, they are the company that I do work for now. I am my, my, my actual title for the company I work for is actually um, um, front end engineer. Technically, I'm a front end developer, but my official title at the company was a front end engineer and has been pretty cool working here. Um, it's officially going to be one full, just about, this is the end of my first week here at the company. Pretty much what's been happening the entire time. I've just been focused on just getting more comfortable with the code base, getting more comfortable with how everything's done. The culture here is amazing. Um, I, when I spoke with one of the managers here, or CTO actually, he said one of the goals that they had was to make sure that they built a strong co company culture, that the people that they hire are positive. I think I'm positive. <laughs> that they, you know, that, that's the main goal and more than just skill and more than just anything. They're, they want people who help build a strong culture that they have here now and so i'm very honored that i get to be part of that now and to work here and yeah man i mean so what's been happening on my first week here they've been giving me tickets on just small bugs to fix um you know for example the facebook debugger why is a different picture showing up when you share it on facebook when another one should show up fix things like that um i you know working on like the terms and privacy policy and etc and more than anything just getting more comfortable with what they're doing and so i've been haven't been working on hard projects but that's honestly usually the norm when you do work for a new company as a front-end developer or engineer uh, you don't just work on tough things right away but you kind of just get kind of get put into it get more comfortable and then when the time comes it goes crazy uh, but it's been cool man i'm really excited to work here uh, for example we have front-end developer meetings every wednesday at 8 a.m um and right now what's going to happen is that we're really implementing how to get to really implement Vue.js into our system and I'm not sure exactly what the plans are but I'm pretty excited and I'm very thankful that I got to work at Vue.js in my other company and I was actually pretty excited and I enjoy learning that library within itself more than even React and so the fact that I get to now do this um, here at this company, the Entrepreneur Magazine, a magazine I've actually been reading throughout my like my teens and when I was in college, college age, when I was working for my dad's, my stepdad's company. And it's kind of crazy and surreal that I'm working here. And I feel like I came at the right time, which is kind of crazy. So more than that, man, I mean, yeah, this is my company. I work for Entrepreneur. I am a front end engineer and it feels so good to make this video because I've, you see so many negative comments. Some people on, on, on YouTube leaving comments like, Chris, you're not a real developer. You're nothing. You don't know much code. And then here we go. This company hires me to be a front end developer, an engineer, a Vue, a Vue.js developer. Um, and not even that. Now I'm even working with some PHP, which is kind of cool. Front end basic PHP, but I mean, it's nice being able to work with different things. And uh, to be able to work for a company like this, one thing, at least for me, it shows that I am valuable. Right, I do, I can, and I do bring value to a company. Uh, I am better than what I often would think because I don't have a degree. Right? I got hired at Entrepreneur Magazine with no degree, and it's all started also because I did learn at TeamTreehouse.com. You know, um, I learned the basic stuff, but going through the tech degree at Team Treehouse, honestly, it really helped me. Like I said in my videos, and I'll link them below, maybe. But where I talk about how learning Vue.js and React at Treehouse has really helped me 
it really increased my skills as a JavaScript developer too. So I'm really excited to get heavy in those projects. And yeah, man, this is crazy. But anyway, man, I got a lot of plans and things to do, especially since they allow me to just film bits and pieces here and there in the office. Yeah, man, a lot of plans. Des life is growing, the channel's growing, and I just can't believe that we are where we are now, you know? So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead, guys. Um, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just end the video here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Maybe it's short, I don't know, but I'll see you guys next time. I'll post another video sometime next week. But if you like videos like this, or just let me know what questions do you have about what I do at my company. Leave me a comment below. What do you wanna see? What kind of things could I talk about or film on my future companies too? Um, <laughs> yeah, so I'll go ahead and I'll make sure I'll see you guys later on um, my end of vlog here. See you guys later. This is, this is Krishan, this is Lifeboat Developer, and I'm out. Peace.